refrigeration units down here and the pumps and then the brains are inside that closet okay so this is what we got we got a Ranko stand down here you can see it's 82 degrees in there Condenser. Absolutely 1000% plug condenser. Uh, there's our TSP right there. Oh. Let's see if I can get this panel off. We can take a look at the condenser coil. Okay, so <clears throat> you can tell this thing's been having high head issues. We got a If you're just staring into it, but it's totally compacted. Oh, pretty cool. Oh, not too bad. Uh, way down in there, it's, the air is not getting through, so we got to do a big old scrub out and a blowout on it. Nemo, what's up, Nemo? water pumps it circulates goes through a heat exchanger to get cooled off by the refrigeration unit here so they can maintain the temperature in here this one does this one does tides and all kinds of cool stuff another tip of the day you get a big old towel and you get it damp and this is going to go behind the condenser i'll show you to blow all the crap into this so we don't make a big old mess in the restaurant so let me just show you guys. It's a big old towel, you get it down. Alright, so the towel got uh, caught most of the stuff. And look at that pile right there. And then there's that's a big old pile of shoe that's in the coil. Yep, yeah, that's a stacked up coil. That's what happens. She was running mega high head. Let me get this all cleaned up. Alright, look at that. Alright, so I scooped that from under the condenser fan. That's all the stuff that came out of the coil. We just got backed up in there. So it took a combination of me getting it wet and then you gotta get your nitro out and really get them clean, but she's all cleaned up now. Whew. That's a perfect example of backing up a condenser coil. Thinking it's clean, but it's not. And uh, We'll get this thing back and up and running here in a sec.